Yo, what's up guys? Today we're watching the Looney Tunes show. And if you guys want us to watch more Looney Tunes show, get this video to 9,000 likes or else, or else. And this video was streamed live on Twitch at twitch.tv slash spilling the milk. Come check us out. We might be live right now. Click subscribe, please. We want you to click it. Dude, I've seen like 300 white women that look exactly like this woman right here. The duck bill and all? Yes. She's got a duck. <laughs> White women be like, bro, holy shit. Yo, shout out to the white women with the duck faces. We love you here. How's the wizard business going? Great, lots of magic, spells, things like that. Wait, what kind of wizard is Daffy? How old is he? Is he 29 years old or 30? He's making the wizard bong that Joe Biden smokes his good kush out of. So is this like after the show? Like, are they old now and retired or something? Like, it's the BoJack Horseman of uh, of Looney Tunes. They're washed up fucking actors, and they're chilling. And they're chilling. What you just described is a date. I'm not going on a date with you. <laughs> Why do you have to say it like that? What a fucking asshole. A date with you. That was like a core delivery right there. You wanna go on a romantic date Friday night? I mean, would you love to? No, you idiot. Ask a woman. Gay. <laughs> Porky is gay. Holy. Ask a woman. Whoa, Bugs is enforcing his heterosexual values onto Daffy right now. It's weird that Bugs would have that perspective considering how often he likes to cross-dress. No woman should be judged on her looks. But if I had to, I'd say you're about a four and a half. How was he pulling all these girls and then he fumbles the bag so hard? I guess uh, women really want to fuck ducks, apparently. It's something I... Did not know prior. Dude, you weren't joking when you were saying this is like Bojack. This is Bojack for kids. Like, what the fuck is the Bojack for kids? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a weird way to answer that. No, 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 no. I, I wasn't talking to you. I almost hit an oil truck. Lola is absolutely <laughs> insane in this show. She is like the best character by far. You need to understand women. So. I've written you a script. So they put the two dumbest characters in a situation where they need advice? This is the thing, when it comes to relationships, you never ask a guy friend for help. Like, that's literally rule one. But it's Lola Bunny, though. She hit an oil truck yesterday. I don't know. I don't know if we trust her. Here's a good idea. Let's get rid of all of our other friends and only be friends with each other. Wait, is she falling in love? She's falling in love with Daffy. We should cut off family members that don't support our relationship. Is this a relationship or a cult? What is Lola onto right now? Oh my god, she's into her. Why is she so into him? This really works on women? She has Stockholm Syndrome. She like wants to be kidnapped or something. Like what? Is this the Bugs c episode? Is Daffy gonna c Bugs Bunny? Finally. Also, aren't Lola and Bugs like cousins or something in this show? Yeah, we have to establish this. It's Lola Bunny and Bugs Bunny. They have the same last name. They're kissing cousins. You know that girl Tina from the copy place? Her beak's even bigger than mine. Well, thanks for the help. I, I like that when Daffy left that scene, he said, I know just the girl. She has a bigger beak Double. than me. Damn. Tina. I was wondering if by any chance you're not doing anything tonight. Someone in chat says, I always thought Tina was Latina for some reason. She does give Latina vibes. If what about her character design are you saying signifies her being Latina, Jack? Well, the thing in my mind is that I find ducks attractive, and I also find Latinas attractive. So there's kind of a Venn diagram going on in my brain. So where does Jenna Ortega fall? Is she like in the middle or something? Half woman, half duck, all sexy. He's bathing in aftershave right now. I mean, they test this stuff on birds, right? So it'll probably be fine. Hello, Daffy. Oh, what? 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 Why is he covering? Okay, why is he covering up? <laughs> he never wears what? clothes. This is sauce, dude. What the hell? Well, thanks again for doing that. I'll make it up to you sometime. How about tonight? Dinner? Oh, uh, I don't know. You gotta eat. They have sex in the Looney Tunes? Like, what the fuck is happening right now? <laughs> Why is this so romantic and, and and suggestive? Bro, look at her outfit, though. Bugs showed up naked and she's fucking busting it down. <laughs> True, Bugs at least put some pants on. Nice place. Yeah, uh, can you just scooch a little bit that way? Thanks, yeah, I just like to be able to see. Oh, this is li this is literally like a fucking Seinfeld episode, man. This is so awkward. <laughs> this is awesome. Stop! This show holds up like way, way better than I was expecting it to, to be honest. 
That's a hot duck. Holy schmoly. Shut the fuck up, man. I, I'd like to be pecking that duck, if you know what I mean. Hey, man, I'm offended at whoever said this bitch is Latina, bro. She nasty as hell, dog. She nasty, yeah, bro. You are the epitome of great. <laughs> <laughs> you can't say this on the first date, Daffy. It's over. Let me take a shot. You're an insecure little weirdo who lies about everything. What <laughs> the fuck? Woo! Well, I guess this date's over. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> you, you were so ready to call it. Uh, someone already took our order. <laughs> wow. Why does Daffy have all the fucking riz in this episode? I f every character wants him. And he, he's a wooging. He's <laughs> he a wooga. That was the awooga sound. This is such a good episode, Cora. I'm so glad you picked this one. Daffy. Daffy's not your boyfriend. I'm your boyfriend. Wait, oh, they are dating. My God. We're boyfriend, girlfriend. I thought you were a waitress. <whistles> wow. She's a keeper. <laughs> <laughs> what does that mean? What the fuck what does, does that, that mean? She's calling her stupid, bro. Do you not speak bitchy girl? Like, hello? That's the best date I've ever had with a wizard. There's something I should tell you. I'm not really a wizard. Oh, he's not a virgin. Oh my goodness, he's not a virgin anymore. He was like, I was one year away from becoming- I was one day away from becoming a, a wizard. Are those for me? <laughs> no, Porky. Dude, Daffy needs to get like hit by a car next episode. Like he deserves pain. This is a nightmare. Every episode is these awkward, awful scenarios. I literally had to deal with this the other day. Like this is literally a real thing. My friend was snoring so loud. This is too real. It's awakening trauma right now. <laughs> Taz? Why is he a little pet? Oh yeah, the Tasmanian devil is their dog. What? The Tasmanian devil is their- look at him! He's their dog! <laughs> That's so fucking funny! He's a little femboy dog. What the- A little femboy dog. I don't think I like that expression. Recipes. You don't cook. Well, I don't have the time. But seven minute meals- He's doing an ad spot in the middle of the episode. What the fuck is doing a Hello Fresh ad right for us, bro? What the hell? Imagine the world where like cartoons start having like YouTuber ad segments in them. What's up guys? I'm Daffy Duck. This video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. That would be crazy. Daffy pulling up with the Raycons, bro. Porky, <laughs> can I see you in my office? It'll be what I do. Dude, Porky works a nine to five. Like, his job is probably some shit. Like, he has to write a bunch of numbers in an Excel sheet and then delete them all before he clocks out for work that day. Like, he has no purpose. And if you'd like, while I'm at it, I can smooth out that bump in your beak. I love this doctor for some reason. I, I really like his voice. It, it's like very authentic for some reason. It's like some, some just Jewish doctor in New York. You're a narcissist? You're a sociopath. You're probably a psychopath. Dude, I wouldn't have known either of any of those words what they meant as a child. That's all I'm saying. This is like sexist. 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 <laughs> sexist. <laughs> Racist. Sexist. Homophobic. Did you want these in color or black and white? <gasps> Do I have a bump on my beak? He just okay. fucking knocked her down. Daffy heard her say, "Do you want this in color?" And he uh, he attacked that woman. She was about to be okay with color. Think about that. He is racist. He's black and racist at the same time. You know, Daffy Duck. He kind of is like Kanye West if you think about it. Why are you here? Maybe because. I work here. Is Bugs a fucking class tourist right now? He's doing like Mr. Beast, like, I went to a third world country for one day. I started working a nine to five job to see how shitty my life could be. And then he's like, whoa, this is so hard. I would kill myself if I had to do this. I want to look like this. First of all, that's a woman. Right. Whoa! What if Daffy's That's fucking no trans, Mr. Doctor? What if Daffy is a trans duck and you're not gonna support him? But maybe he meant like, like that's a human woman, not like a duck woman. It'll be a success when these bandages come off and I show the world the new me. This is just like the sexy Squidward episode. But Daffy's already sexy, so what are they gonna change? Well, they're gonna change his gender. They're literally gonna reverse his fucking duck pussy or whatever. He doesn't have any bandages downstairs. Stop it! You're hurting me! I like he put the nipples in though. <laughs> That's so cute. Very perky. I'm saying that you need to make work fun. 
I don't know, Box. Work is supposed to be miserable, bro. Shut up, man. Just cock in, cock out. Who cares? If you're even, like, sentient while working, are you even working? Like, that shouldn't be, like, not even brain function. Like, what are you gonna yell at your wife about after work? Like, it's gonna look the same. It's gonna look exactly the same. It's a placebo effect. Is he gonna get One. fired today or something? Is like, is this the day that Porky loses his fucking job? He made a paperclip chandelier instead of working. He's getting fired. Hello, world. I'm about to make you a whole lot prettier. Oh my god, they're doing this bullshit where they won't show us the front of his face for like an hour. Like, come on, just let me see it, man. Oh, he's terrifying. He's gonna look awful. They got rid of the duck bill. They got- did they get rid of his bill? Did they just give him like a- like a human nose? A duck? Oh, well, I wasn't sure what that was. We put him in the way back. Bro, they put him in the back. Cause he's black, huh? Cause he's a black duck? Yikes. What's the occasion? Ah! <laughs> He's just a nerd. He's a nerd. That looks disgusting. They made my point to the nerd emoji and it's really sad. When it comes to my appearance, there can be no imperfections. This looks like the white dude that like got plastic surgery to like look like a K-pop star or something and then it looked horrible. This looks like Zac Efron post fucking plastic surgery, man. It, and it looks terrifying. Okay, I come into the conference room. And bring the paper airplane. Oh, he's addicted. He's addicted to being a fucking troll. No. Wait, this is just Courtney's arc in Total Drama. You give a taste of pork to the pig and he can't go back. What about the Papadopoulos returns? The, 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 the Papadopoulos returns. He just shredded them. He just shredded them. <laughs> oh, jingle bells. <laughs> you fired. The man finally had fun at his job and he went crazy. This is why we need the need him to be miserable. Oh, am I fired too? He's like, that turns me on a little, so you're safe for now. Bugs, you're kind of sexy. Uh, I'm just so excited about this new chapter in my life. He can't afford rent, he can't get a date, so he's dating the fucking paperclip girl. This is the saddest moment of my- uh, She does have perky t though, like those- they're like pins on her chest, man, like let's be honest. Porky loves the perkiness, man. Uh, Basketball? Do they ball in? Is that the Lakers? I finally know what I want to do with my life. Be a professional basketball player. Hey. <laughs> Daffy thinks just because he's black, he's going to be a good basketball player. Like, he, he, has a, <laughs> he has a bit of an advantage, but like, you know. He's like, I figured it out. I finally noticed one attribute that's very common. <laughs> he, he watched basketball for one minute. What trans? Trans cable? Finally, we've got the neck the I'm network exclusively for trans people. Hello, yes, trans person on the phone. Yes. We support you. We support trans rights. And that's the day I randomly select one of our customers and turn off their cable. Oh, this is <laughs> fucking evil. Oh my god. Oh my god. No, 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 this, this can't be happening. <laughs> is this episode Bugs Bunny calling cable customer service? Are you fucking kidding me? And he's not even Indian. What the hell? Can't you press a button and turn my cable back on? No, oh, Mr. Buny. This is the only way this turtle feels power. <laughs> this is hell. Anytime I talk to like an internet, like customer service provider, I'm going to imagine them as this turtle. This is 100% the writers just tapped into the every experience they've ever had with customer service. I'm sorry, I'm kind of in a hurry. Which font? Old West or Triberica? Hello? I need a hundred copies of this. I said, give me a minute. Ah, uh, this is like giving me secondhand like anxiety oh, no. the situation. I live in America. If I want to experience this, I can just go fucking in any store. I can go outside <laughs> in any store and experience this. Why do I need a Looney Tunes episode for this? How about my hundred copies? How about I take your head and shove it in that machine and make a hundred copies of your stupid face? You got time for that? Dude, Daffy is ruining his girlfriend's job. Daffy just got his girlfriend fired for scree- Oh my- Can you maybe just spray a little here? Yeah, and here. She's putting the feet for bugs later? Like why- The worker actually sprayed her feet? That is so weird. They will do that if you ask them to. Okay, where- Which stores? Which stores do that? That's actually the secret at Victoria's Secret. Will I still get to make people's lives miserable? <laughs> Only when you're forced to fire someone. 
Welcome aboard. He's self-aware of how terrible he is. I thought he was ignorant. I thought Daffy was ignorant to all of this. Daffy's like like Lola Bunny if she wasn't ignorant. Like he knows he's a piece of shit. He doesn't care. Can you just put our cable back on? Oh, I don't know how to do that. I thought you worked there. I do, but so far I've just been firing people. <laughs> so many people. So many people unemployed. They have families. This is the most toxic workplace known to me. It's like Blizzard customer support or some shit. All I've been doing is firing people and stealing their breast milk. Here we go. You did it. My cable's back on. Is there anything else I can help you with today? He only gave him the fucking- But no, he got fire content. He got the telenovela, bro. Why does the Mexican mouse show up the second they're watching the, the telenovela channel? Maybe I'll just watch a little bit. Oh, he's gonna he's get into, into the telenovelas. <laughs> no, he's gonna get it. They suck you in like that, man. Twin brother? I'm get. I'm starting to get invested in this plot. Dude, I gotta get into telenovelas. I'm not even gonna lie. That sounds like fire. <laughs> they kind of they kind of look fire, not gonna lie. That's the next arc of our channel. I'm on break. Okay, but you better be back by 2.30 or you're fired. What? <laughs> Is this just them, like, having fun doing layoffs? Or, like, they're like, yeah, let's just hire some random guy to fire everyone for us instead. It doesn't matter. Just pick someone. Okay, I've got him. All right. So this customer's in a hurry, but you're already busy doing a bunch of other stuff. This is gonna take like three hours <laughs> yeah. to explain and she's not going to get it. Oh, never mind. Wow, she's- Oh, it's gonna be like a flirtate- Oh my God, he's flirting. Look at him. Light skin stare. Riz Bunny over here. Oh, oh whoa. whoa. I thought she was about to start taking more off, man. I thought it was about to all come off there for a second. Kind of thought I was gonna work here until I figured out what I really wanted to do. Oh, look at her ass, man. What the fuck? Her ass is what literally the poking fuck? out. What the fuck? Oh yeah. Oh my god. Ew! 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 Why Yo! did she? She did the. Huh? What would you do with that customer? I drop everything and do whatever he said. He's my customer, and my customer is my world. <laughs> Welcome to the coffee hut. My name is Becky. Oh my god, what? 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 Finally, we were missing on the cross-dressing content in these three episodes. Bugs' plan is to seduce the turtle, f him, and then never text him back. Is that what's gonna happen here? I just want to go to the 22nd floor. Well, there's a number of ways to get to the 22nd floor. Ah, uh, you can get the silver package. <laughs> oh my god, the amount of pettiness. <laughs> this is the perfect amount of pettiness for this situation. It's the the writer's dream of getting back at the customer service worker, just like being able to appear and just make their lives inconvenient. Where is everyone? Where am I? The future. What? What the fuck is this? Is this Daffy? This is Daffy. No, this is Bugs again. Wait, no, this is Daffy. This is Daffy. Mr. Beauty. It's pronounced bunny. Damn it. It's fucking bu- God damn it. I should have stuck with my gut. It's okay, man. Just get more confidence next time. You got it. Man, did you watch all those Scooby-Doo episodes for nothing? You can't even predict this guy. While you're at it, why don't you throw in the Spanish language channel? Hey, he's always come around. Hey, he's looking up for Speedy, though. That respect. That respect you looking up for my boy. You're fired. What? Go ahead and clear out your desk. Well, that's everyone. He fired everyone who works here. Well, that's everyone. Lindsay is the American foreign exchange student living in the hacienda with Dr. Jimenez. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is he giving birth? Yeah. Live pregnancy scene on Looney Tunes show. Es un niño. Es hermoso. The baby has a stash. That is racist as fuck. What the fuck? He's a father. <gasps> eh. I'll watch the finals next year. Yo, he'd rather watch the telenovela than the finals. That's crazy. <laughs> and if you guys want to watch our telenovela, then go Patreon. Thank you, patrons. $10 plus. Thank you. Thank you, Ace and Hole, Alan, Alfredo, Argafargador, Autumn, Black Man Bubs, Case, Crescent, Dan, Dan Tepic, Detone, Dead Man, Dusty, Dylan, Doggo, Duck, Elizabeth, Fat Pup, Trev, Heather, Helmboy, K99, Caitlin, Kamui, Carter, Kya, Kyla, Esses, Madison, Mario, Matthew, Michael, Delta, PBJ, Ryan, Sam, Simpsonwarmer, Chimar, Tatum, Trippy Ducky, True, Whitiverse, Yothog, Angel, Texan, Atomic, Ava, Black Knight, Blank, Bunny, Corgi, Daniel, Daniel Hyena, Forrest, Jake, Chrissy, King Red, Marquizel, Matthew, Netlith, Quentin, Arthur Mercy, Rashawn, Reverted, Stellar, Sully, Tech, Tyson. Thanks.